10 ongoing and completed projects in Sierra Leone. In this video, we will take a look at the most impressive completed projects in Sierra Leone. These projects are a testament to the country's progress and its commitment to improving the lives of its citizens. But before we start, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I will be uploading new videos about Africa every week, and I would love for you to join me on this journey. Now let's get started. Project 10, the Freetown Peninsula Ring Road. Freetown's capital city is encircled by the 27-kilometer long Freetown Peninsula Ring Road. The road's $200 million construction project was finished in 2018. The road has greatly facilitated traffic flow and made it simpler for people to move around Freetown. A significant infrastructure development that has significantly impacted the lives of Freetown's residents is the Freetown Peninsula Ring Road. The road has improved access to jobs and services, decreased traffic congestion, and made it simpler for people to move around the city. Due to the road's increased appeal to businesses and investors, Freedom's economy has also seen growth. Project 9. Lungi Bridge Project One of Sierra Leone's most challenging projects is the Lungi Bridge Project. The bridge will span the Sierra Leone River and connect Freetown with the Lungi International Airport, which is situated across the river. This bridge's construction will speed up trade and tourism while reducing travel time. The project is being funded by the Chinese government and is expected to cost around $2.1 billion. Project 8, the Bambuna Hydropower Dam. In Sierra Leone's northern province, on the Bambuna River, there is a hydroelectric dam called the Bambuna Hydropower Dam. $300 million was spent on the $300 million dam, which was finished in 2015. Electricity is supplied by the dam to Freetown and other regions of Sierra Leone. A significant infrastructure development that has significantly impacted people's lives in Sierra Leone is the Bumguna Hydropower Dam. Millions of people who previously lacked access to electricity now have it thanks to the dam. The dam has also increased Sierra Leone's economic growth by attracting more businesses and investors. Project 7, The Bow Waterside Market the Bow Waterside Market is a new market that is located in the city of Bow in the southern province of Sierra Leone. The market was constructed at a cost of $100 million and was completed in 2019. The market provides a safe and secure place for people to buy and sell goods. The Bow Waterside Market is a major infrastructure project that has had a significant impact on the lives of people in Bow. The market has provided a safe and secure place for people to buy and sell goods. The market has also helped to boost the economy of Bo by attracting more businesses and tourists. Project 6. The Kenema City Hall The Kenema City Hall is a new city hall that is located in the city of Kenema in the eastern province of Sierra Leone. The city hall was constructed at a cost of $50 million and was completed in 2018. The city hall provides a place for the city government to operate and for people to gather for events. The Kenema City Hall is a major infrastructure project that has had a significant impact on the lives of people in Kenema. The City Hall provides a place for the city government to operate and for people to gather for events. The City Hall has also helped to boost the economy of Kenema by attracting more businesses and tourists. Project 5. The Port Loco Bridge The Port Loco Bridge is a new bridge that was constructed across the Port Loco River in the northern province of Sierra Leone. The bridge was constructed at a cost of $150 million and was completed in 2020. The bridge has significantly improved transportation in the northern province and has made it easier for people to get around the region. The Port Loco Bridge is a significant infrastructure undertaking that has significantly impacted the lives of people in Sierra Leone's northern province. People now find it simpler to get to work, school and doctor's appointments thanks to the bridge's shortened travel time between Port Loco and other regions of the nation. Additionally, the bridge has made it simpler for companies to transport goods and services, which has improved the area's economy. Project 4. The Waterloo Water Treatment Plant In the Waterloo neighborhood of Freetown, a brand new water treatment facility called the Waterloo Water Treatment Plant was built. 2019 saw the completion of the $100 million plant's construction. The plant has increased Freetown's access to clean water and enhanced the well-being of its citizens. The Waterloo Water Treatment Plant is a major infrastructure project that has had a significant impact on the lives of people in Freetown. The plant has increased the availability of clean water, which has helped to reduce the incidence of waterborne diseases. 
The plant has also helped to improve the quality of life for people in Freetown, as they no longer have to worry about finding clean water to drink, cook, and bathe with. Project 3. The Bow Government Hospital The Bow Government Hospital is a new hospital that was constructed in the city of Bow. The hospital was constructed at a cost of $200 million and was completed in 2020. The hospital has increased the availability of healthcare services in Bow and has improved the health of the city's residents. Bow's residents have benefited greatly from the construction of the Bow Government Hospital, a significant infrastructure project. The hospital has expanded the range of healthcare options, which has decreased the number of patients who must travel to Freetown for care. People in Bow now don't have to stress about looking for a hospital that can give them the care they require, which has helped to improve their quality of life. Project 2. The Kenma Government Hospital The Kenma Government Hospital is a new hospital that was constructed in the city of Kenema. The hospital was constructed at a cost of $150 million and was completed in 2019. The hospital has increased the availability of healthcare services in Kenema and has improved the health of the city's residents. A significant infrastructure development that has greatly impacted the lives of the residents of Kenema is the Kenma Government Hospital. The hospital has expanded the range of healthcare options, which has decreased the number of patients who must travel to Freetown for care. People in Kenema no longer have to worry about finding a hospital that can give them the care they require, which has helped to improve their quality of life. Project 1. The Freetown Waterloo Road The Freetown Waterloo Coastal Road is a new road that is being built along the coast of Freetown. The road is being funded by the European Union and is expected to cost $100 million. The road is scheduled to be completed in 2023 and will improve access to the city's port and airport. The Freetown Waterloo Coastal Road will give Sierra Leone's economy a significant boost. It will facilitate the business transportation of goods and draw outside investment. Additionally, the road will make it simpler for Sierra Leoneans to get to and from the airport and port of the city. Over 5,000 jobs are anticipated to be created during construction and another 1,000 after the road opens. Additionally, it will contribute to bettering Freetown's clogged traffic flow. These are just a few of the many completed projects in Sierra Leone. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, please like and subscribe to my channel. I will be uploading new videos about Africa every week, and I would love for you to join me on this journey.